He was the Stanford Regional Most Outstanding Player last year, going 14 for 20. And Peyton Jones missing with ball one. On the ground is short. Routine for Owen Cobb. Throws it wildly to first, pulling Carter Graham off the bag. And an error to start the day for Stanford defensively. And Zach Liu is on. Strike three called on a fastball, 94 from Scott, two down. Just missed, and there's two on. A lot of five for nine in the regional. Goes back up the middle, and a single to center. Zach Liu being waved, he will score. And an RBI single with two outs, and Maddox Lotta gives Cal State Fullerton the early lead. Line to short, sliding stop, Owen Cobb, and too late to second base, an infield hit. That ball hits squarely by Carter White, and they're loaded for Cal State Fullerton now. One-two pitch, yeah. fastball in there, strike three called. Matt Scott wiggles out of it, gives up an unearned run in this elimination game, and Montgomery loops one over first, and a nice sandwich that plops in for a hit. Was able to muscle it up over first base. Position makes a mistake. Got him with the curve, struck him out. First strikeout for Peyton Jones. Two outs, Drew Bowser will be the batter. Strike three. Bowser goes down, and the Cardinals strand the leadoffs hit from Montgomery. That one lined to left. Alberto Rios, it's over his head, and it's over the wall. Home run. Just got out of here. A low line drive, and Ehrman his fourth of the year. 2-0 Cal State Fullerton. Well, in order to advance in regionals, guys that normally don't leave the yard are going to leave the yard. Play for the Sharks. Becerra goes the other way and pushes one to right. And leadoff single hit number three for the Cardinal. Becerra was banged up. Strike three called outside edge to Cobb. Didn't like it. Third strikeout for Jones, one gone, and Eddie Park coming up. Back up the middle, Eddie Park a single. Becerra rounding, turns on the Jets, racing for third and dives in. Terrific base running by Becerra, reading that play beautifully. Swing and a high fly ball to center. Guzman back, warning track, leaps, gone, home run, Tommy Troy. Number 16 for Tommy Troy, and Stanford has the lead. Well, it's a 2-0 fastball, and you throw 2-0 fastballs to Tommy Troy, middle, middle, and up, and he will deposit it into the trees, and that's exactly what he does right here. Tommy Troy's three-run shot oh, in the top of the inning, giving Stanford the lead as Nankill places one into right center for a hit. Chugging for two, and he'll make it with a stand-up double to start the third for the Titans. And that's ball four, and there's two on. Bobo walks for a second time. Bunted in front of the plate, picked up Dugan as one play. Gets the out at first. And a curve, a comebacker off the glove of Dugan. Cobb throws low to first, and Carter, Graham can't dig it out. Tie game. Bunning. First base side, Carter Graham has trouble with it. Too late. Stanford's their own worst enemy right now. Reaching forward to bounce it to short. Cobb to Drew Bowser, that's all they'll get. Get the out at second base. And they have the runner hung up as breaking was Cole Ehrman. Drew Bowser chasing him back. Now throws, breaking for the plate and out. And running into and out of the plate was Carter White as Cal State Fullerton tried to catch the Cardinal napping. And Rios rips it to left and it falls in front of Carter White. Stanford has gotten the leadoff guy on now in each of the last three innings. Bowser pulls it through the left side. And Stanford's got two on with one out, and here comes Timo Becerra. Yeah. Did he go? Yes, he did. He tried to hold up. 
And there's two gone. The second strikeout for Hinkle. That will leave it up to Owen Cobb. Cobb, a weak grounder, tough play. Hinkle stumbles, falls down, and the ball dribbles over to first. They're loaded. Infield hit for Cobb. That's ball four, and we got a tie game. That's a prototypical Eddie Park at bat. That's who he is. That's who he is. One strike pitch. Yeah. Troy lines it to center. And that is a basket catch in center field by Moises Guzman. Experience. Yeah, they do. You know, the mindset is, hey, we've been here before, right? We've done this before. And so it's just about, hey, you know, we got to play well to do that. But, but the experiences there haven't gone through and played through the loser's bracket. In the air, right center field from Nankill. This is going to carry all the way to the wall. Around third, they're going to send Jack Haley. Drew Bowser will not make a relay throw. Two out RBI double, and the Titans go back on top. Second double for Nankill. Another inning with a run. Pop back behind the plate. Malcolm Moore will have a play. And he's got it to retire the side. And Bowser draws a one-out walk. Stanford has a base runner. Frustrated with himself. Becerra drive. Left field. Carter White back. Timo Becerra home run. Stanford takes the lead. The second of the season for Becerra. Well, we talked about in order to keep winning and advancing in the postseason, you're going to need production from the ones that have not really produced in Becerra. It's a fastball in and he doesn't miss it. She have to save up, I guess. Bouncer left side, tough play and it gets through into left. Off the glove of Jack Haley in a three hit game for Tommy Troy. Lead off base runner, hit number 10 for Stanford. Jojo Ingracia, pitch, bounce back up the middle, could be two, the shovel, Maddox lot of the turn. Nicely done. Second time in the last three innings, Cal State Fullerton turns a double play. On the ground and through in a three-hit game for Nate Nankill and a leadoff base runner for Cal State Fullerton. Did he go? Runner breaks late. Malcolm Moore throw down a second in time and out. Nate Nankill tried to take off on a pitch that bounced. And Malcolm Moore guns him down. This is a great job by the freshman. Owen Cobb was able to get a good read on. Yeah. Elevating Dowd gets the strikeout. Well, the most important part of that. In the air, right field, playable. Braden Montgomery circles under it. Side retired, kept him in the lineup. Chase that one, but it gets away from Ehrman. And a strikeout wild pitch, Alberto Rios is on. Bouncing ball toward the hole, cut off. Zach Lou to second, on to first, not in time. They force Rios at second. There's two outs, and that'll bring up Becerra. Becerra, ground ball to short. Jack Haley throws out Becerra. Titans are coming up. Thomas Wilson was here, and that drills Guzman. And a one-out base runner. The tying run is on for the Titans. And he lost him, and there's two on. Bruno has walked two here in the eighth. Strike three called. Went with the changeup and he caught him looking. And Cobb strikes out, one gone in the ninth. And a ground ball at the first base side. And Caden Connor tags Eddie Park going by. Out number two. Gracia, the 2 1. Troy hits it sharply on the ground in a four hit game for Tommy Troy. Ground ball, right side, diving, tumbling, but then Tommy Troy wildly goes around second and gets back. That's an infield hit for Carter Graham. Took advantage of the hole that was open and reaching in Maddox. A lot of phenomenal job just to get it. At third, Zach Lou goes the short way to Forrest Graham. We go to the bottom of the nine. Back and forth in this one. Bouncer over the mound, and it gets through the sliding. Becerra, who's in at shortstop for Stanford. As a change, he was DHing, and now he's in at short. And that is a single for Caden Connor, and the tying run is on. Gets it down. 
Carter Graham underhands for the out as Caden Connor takes second with Drew Bowser covering at first base. Did he go? He went around, tried to hold up. Strike three called, ball game. Another changeup from Bruno. And the Stanford Cardinals survived the elimination game. 6-5. They hang on to beat Cal State Fullerton.